Charles II and his escape into exile by Martin B. Beardsley. That just seems like a very stereotypical British last name. <laughs> um, but um, you're getting 21 different, not 21 different, but 21 chapters um, and appendix A and B. So you're getting topics like the road to Orchester, the Battle of Orchester, um, Jane Lane from Long Marston, Bridport, um, Brighton Departure Freedom. So starts off with um, a little bit of information about like his dad Charles I and um, the world he was born into, like the life. Um, and like at the end of each chapter you get like commentary so basically a summary of like the chapter, like a bullet point version. And um, so it's just like people and events like introduced and like you get like a dot in between each new thing um you get kind of like a timeline from a certain point to um his death so it's basically a biography but um it does have like the that focus of exile um and you do get like primary and photographic um images um which is mainly like at the end so like Charles going to Scotland where his like exile was. Um, his father versus like everyone else versus like Cro Cromwell. Um, well, Charles II against Cromwell. Um, it's somewhat like yeah, it's a biography, but it's not like totally feeling like a traditional biography because it is has that um, one focus of his life. Um, so it's just basic setup. Like um, he was born, and a little information about his dad, and so. It is nice for those um, who do have an interest in Charles II and does give um, a, a look into uh, like certain time in his life and different. There are a few different topics and like battles and stuff that are talked about as well. Um, so. That played a part in um, like that exile part of his life so yeah um, Charles II and his escape into exile happy readings